What's going on everybody? My name is Kermit and welcome back to the cube. SMP episode 50 something. 50 something. Oh dude, I just reached for my beard. My beard is gone, my friends. My girlfriend made me shave. <laughs> Which isn't that bad. I also really, really, really need to get a haircut. Look at this. Look at look at all this. What, what the heck is going on, Kermit? Why do you look like a hobo? I don't I don't know, man. I don't know. I've just been inside for the past six months playing Minecraft. <laughs> so, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the cube. We got a couple things to talk about, but before we do that, I wanted to talk about something face cam related. Face cam related. Me personally, my body, my human physical body. I have a creeper tattoo. Yes, indeed. You probably see it on my on my right arm right here. I got this creeper tattoo in Orlando, Florida. Last uh, last Minecon. It was on my last day while I was in Orlando, Florida. I had 50 buckets, 50 buckets. Yeah, I, I had 50 buckets in my pocket and I traded all of those buckets to this tattoo artist and he was like, yo man, I will take that 50 buckets, those 50 buckets and I will trace this image right here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is my, this is my phone case. I actually got in Minecon as well. It's getting, ooh, it's actually getting a little beat up. I don't know if you guys can see that. Oh, the corners, man. Oh, look, oh man. That is field tested right there. That's poop. Anyway, uh, I asked him to trace that image and put it on my arm, and he was like, yo, that'll cost you 50 buckets. <laughs> and that was that. Um, it is not done. I still plan on adding to it. Um, I don't know when I'm going to add to it. I also have other tattoo ideas I want to uh, implement first. But, uh, yeah, we just want to get that out of the way. A lot of you guys were like, oh, my God, you have a tattoo? No way. I actually have, I actually have six tattoos. Uh, we might, I might show them off some other time, but uh, I have one on here and one on my leg, which I have shown you guys from different pictures. You could look it up on Instagram or Tumblr or something. I don't even know. Anyway, back to the cube. We need to talk about the cube, my friends. The cube. Um, I hopped on this morning and I know you guys probably can't see it because my face cam is covering up, but we are cruising. We're cruising at a solid 20 FPS right now. Maybe 15. 15? 17? 12, 15, it's getting better. It's getting a little bit better. Um, I've actually been on the server for a little bit, so it might not be as great as it was when I first logged on, but spawn was a lot better this morning, and that makes me excited. That makes me excited. Hopefully, um, the lag, the freaking FPS issues don't haunt me forever. Oh, wait, they're, they're kind of, oh, 30, oh, 12, okay. Yeah, it goes up and down, it goes up and down. Anyway, we've got a couple things to talk about in spawn. First things first. I'm the realist, and second thing, second, let's talk about this bad boy. Let's talk about this bad boy. So I brought up a couple different ideas. In fact, let's go on in here. Um, I guess I should let you guys know, I have actually implemented a bucket of lava inside of this trap because I didn't really want the villagers to spawn infinitely and cause a bunch of lag because obviously if you spawn anything infinitely, it doesn't... It's not very, it's not very survival, it's not very multiplayer friendly, I guess. Um, and so I put a bucket of lava somewhere in that pathway, somewhere in the UFO, and I just kind of wanted to wait until I had more of this figured out before I start mass producing freaking villagers with no home, nowhere to go, nowhere to go, villagers, nowhere to go. Well, anyway, uh, so the villagers are decreasing in numbers because I've been killing them off. We got a couple of armors, one of, the, or that, uh, one librarian a shepherd and a farmer, and we are still needing to redesign this place. We still need to redesign this entire place, and we still need to build the individual pens for, in fact, oh, I might just hire like Dolphin or something. Yeah, I might just hire Dolphin to come and build me this crap, dude. I don't know how to do this. I mean, I have a couple ideas. These are my ideas. These are my ideas. So every piece of wood will be replaced with a hmm, prismarine block, hmm, maybe, 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 I don't know, Are, does anybody sell any of those prismarine blocks? Let, let me go run around spawn real quick, I want to go look and see if anybody sells these prismarine blocks and see if we can get any reference, um, I might actually just run on into the freaking Dude, I hate how HBOM's store is laid out. Ah, oh, it's so disorganized. Anyway, I'm gonna go look for Prismarine Blocks, and I might run into the Guardian Farm, 
Um, I'll see you guys in just a second. <clears throat> oh, all right. So we got some prismarine blocks in Grazer's shop. Five gold. Okay, ingots, ingots. That's not bad. That's not bad. I thought it was about to be gold blocks. I was like, fool, you crazy. I ain't paying you five gold nothing. Five gold nothing for you. Okay, let's get ourselves you know, a couple ingots, a couple blocks. I don't know how. We might just buy them all out. We might need, or we're probably going to need all of them and then more some. So we're probably just going to, what, that's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40? 40 gold ingots? 40 gold ingots. So we'll leave one little stack of eight for whoever, whoever chances upon that. So what do we need? 40? Ooh, okay, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Just got to drop off six of those. And here you go, my friend. Here you go. 40 gold ingots for you. 64 prismarine blocks for me. Get out of here. All right, so I don't know. There. So there are three different prismarine blocks, if I am correct. You've got these guys. You've got the, um, no, okay. So these are the prismarine bricks. You've got prismarine blocks, and then you got dark prismarine, right? Right? I, mean, that's, I think that's right. I think that's right. So we've got, oh, uh, what should I use for stairs? Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Hmm. Hmm. Aha! I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Crap. Boop. All right, so I've put down like 12 different blocks, and I already know this is going to be pretty sweet. So I'm going to replace all of the green stained clay with these prismarine blocks. I'm going to replace all of the wood with these dark prismarine, and I'm going to replace the glass with different stuff as well. And that brings me to my next topic. I need to go find myself a nice silk touch enchantment for my pickaxe here so I can get all this glass so it doesn't get all wasted, you know? So I'm pretty sure H-Bomb should have some enchantment books, maybe? Silk touch? Silk touch, please! Oh, I think this might be it. Smite. Uh, infinity. Uh, flame. Power. Luck of the sea. Oh, actually, that could be useful. Unbreaking. Come on, so touch. Come on, please. Ah, oh, what the heck? Come on. Come on. Oh, it's not over. It's not over. Wait, what was that? Oh, man, there's two one. Oh, dang it. No. Oh, that's a load of poop. That's a load of poop. What? Oh, okay. I think there there's some other people out there, though, that sell silk, silk Touch, I do believe. Let's go stop by Parker's store next. Yay! Parker's store got Silk Touch 1 for 7 gold blocks, which is not that bad. All we need is 3 more from our bank, which isn't that bad. How much are we at now? How much are we at? We are at... Come on, man. Right click. Oh, we're still out of stack. That's, that's freaking awesome. That is freaking good to see. Good to see. Um, I have been, or I have not been doing any AFK fishing. My store has been absolutely depleted as of late. And that's not, that's not very cool. That is not very cool. Unfortunately, I just have not been spending very much time on Minecraft as I usually have, or as I have been in the past. Okay, I'm going to pay. I'm going to pay, and then I'm going to talk. I got this. I got that. Let's go enchant. Um, lately, I just have not been spending that much time actually playing. No, I've been spending time recording, and uh, I don't know. I don't know, man. I've just been super busy. Oh, it only costs seven freaking levels. That is nice. Uh, actually, after this weekend, after this weekend, I will be done moving, and after that, we can start getting a good schedule down. Because that, honestly, I really think a good schedule would help us out a lot. If I could say, hey, Every day, there's going to be a video up at this time. Then you guys know when to check your YouTube feed if you guys want to see a Kermit video. Or every day, or every week, this day, this time, I'll be streaming. That would be really awesome as well. Okay, anyway, we can save that for another conversation. Hopefully, I can get that figured out. But, uh, yeah, so let's start taking out all this glass. I've got to get some more dark prismarine. I think I am going to go over to the freaking... Um, what is it called? Guardian Farm? The Guardian Farm, because I am going to need some more prismarine blocks for these pillars. And for these stairs. For these stairs. I think I'm going to leave them there for now. For now. I think I might change them out later. 
Holy shit! Oh fuck! Oh shit! No, what? <laughs> oh. And a freaking course, a freaking course, a freaking creeper comes behind me and blows me up. What a load of poop, man. Anyway, we can get some dirt from up here. I don't know if we've ever gonna going to expand to the spawn up here. I've always wanted to just flatten this entire area out, but it would be so much freaking work. We'd be able to do it if we actually worked together on something. That would be nice. That would be nice. But, uh, okay, so hopefully I can flatten this out. I actually think I also blow up, blew up like a sandstone slab from this shop over here. This Bayani's build shop. Kiani's build shop. I'm sorry. <laughs> Kiani forever. Kiani forever. Alright, well, anyway, what I was trying to say was for the stairs, we're gonna leave them there for now. Uh, we might change them out to like quartz stairs or something else later. Uh, if I decide to, I don't know yet. We'll see how it looks when this is all done. All right, anyway, I'm off to work. I gotta go get some glass. I've gotta get some uh, prismarine blocks. And I will see you guys once I've got, once I've got, uh, I think I'm just gonna do the front door. I'll do the rest off screen. We're gonna get the front door done so I want, cause I wanna see what it'll look like. And then yeah, I'll see you guys soon. <clears throat> oh, I pressed the wrong freaking button. Press the wrong button, what the heck? <laughs> Alright, well that's as far as I got. Uh, I, I just ran out of blocks. And I don't know what I'm gonna do with the bushes and with this. I don't know if I should just make all of this purple or make it all like maybe lime green or something. And then with the bushes, I think I might replace it with like uh, maybe sponges. Maybe maybe instead of going after an alien thing, we could just go after like a underwater guardian theme. If we, if we were to go with sponges, that would be the case at least. Um, if not, we could do sea lanterns, but that would be, that would cost, that would be a lot of sea lanterns. I don't know if that's even possible. Um, sea lanterns, sponges, maybe glowstone? Glowstone might be doable. We could do glowstone uh, for the leaves. Because I, I want, what I want to do is I want to basically have the exact same building, but just completely different blocks. Or maybe not completely different blocks because we're still going to be using some of this, uh, some of this white glass, I think. Just for convenience's sake, let's get that, some of these blocks back. And then, I'm pretty sure, can we make, let's see, how do you freaking make those dark blocks? There's a way to craft them, but I just don't know what it is. I might have to go to the interwebs to figure it out. Maybe it's like, I think it's like list with like shards. Oh, no, 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 yeah, that's right, I need the shards, I need the shards. All right, I'm gonna go over to the guardian farm, and I'm gonna pick up whatever is left off down there. So, see you guys in a second. By the way, the reason why I look down at my keyboard every time I'm about to stop recording is because I have to look down and press the H button. The H button is my recording button. It starts recordings and it stops recordings and all that fun jazz. Hmm. You guys think it still works? <laughs> It's been a while since I've been back here. I have no idea if this thing works at all. I think like a couple of them dropped. Right when I right when I uh, turned the corner, I saw two of them drop. But... Oh! Oh, look! Hello, friend! Oh, man! Oh, what the shit? Go! Yeah! Oh. That, that was not planned. But all right. We got to come down here anyway. Um, okay, sweet. So they are dying. And nice! That's not bad. I kind of want a lot, a lot more of these would be nice. Um, I guess we'll just take some shards. Let me see. Let me see what the shards are useful for. I'll be right back. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. We all we need, all we need, my friends, is we're going to get rid of this dirt. Actually, no, we're going to keep the dirt, get rid of this spruce wood. Grab these ink sacks. Do we have a crafting table? We do not have a crafting table. All we need to do is combine these ink sacks with the prismarine shards, which is awesome. Actually, let me go back down here. Because while I was uh, while I was on the interwebs, I heard a couple more dudes spawn. And I want more crystals, man! So the crystals are what are used to make the uh, the lamps, the sea lantern lamps. The sea lantern lanterns. And yeah, we are probably not gonna be using those since those are quite expensive to build. But we can do this, check this out. So we should be able to do 
that. Okay, so we only get one, one prismarine block per eight shards. Mm -hmm. That is a little pricey, actually. Um, but it's not bad. We got 24 blocks pretty easily. Let's go actually, um, let's go grab a couple more shards. We're going to grab a couple more shards and I will meet you guys back at the greenhouse once we're done with this. Oh, it's raining, it's pouring. I don't really like the weather right now, but it's all right. I live in Seattle. I'm kind of used to it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, I got 42 freaking prismarine, dark prismarine blocks. Uh, but before I start placing this down, I want to get you guys' opinions. So, opinions, guys. What should we do with the rest of this? Or basically, what, what overall theme should we go after? Because originally I was going to go after some sort of alien theme. But as I'm building this more and more with these uh, the temple blocks, the underwater temple blocks, it's kind of starting to look like just an underwater alien market. <laughs> Underwater alien market. That's good. Yeah, there's my title right there. That is awesome. Um, so we're going to keep on building this. I want you guys to let me know what you think I should replace the leaves with and what color scheme I should go for when it comes to the glass. Because most of this, most of this thing is made out of glass. And so that is going to be, that is going to be a big factor. I think I'm going to ask for two colors, two glass colors. And depending on what those two colors is, kind of depends on the the rest of the theme, I guess. Since those two colors are going to be the most used coloring system theme. I don't even know what I'm talking about. But anyway, uh, yeah, let's go replace the rest of this. Oh, I also, got, I also got a bunch of this prismarine, so we could use this as well. Um, I don't know if these are really that good. Maybe we'll use them for like the ground or something. I think that would make more sense. And uh, somebody told me, now I don't know, I don't know if this is true, but somebody told me that this prismarine changes colors. Like it changes from blue to purple. Does it? Dude! Dude! I think it does. That, that's intense. I did not know that. It's definitely getting darker. Holy shit! That is awesome! Color changing blocks? I did not know that. That is pretty sweet. Yeah, I can change from like blue to green to purple. Ooh, yeah, we're definitely gonna be using a lot of that on the ground, especially since it's so easy to get as well. Um, I have a couple stacks of it back in that Guardian farm. Okay, anyway, let's continue on with the build. I'm gonna continue replacing this with Dark Prismarine, and I'll pop back in uh, to show you guys what that looks like. All right, guys. I actually, I actually really needed to pop in for this moment. This moment is probably the first moment that this place is gonna become useful. Look at this. I'm gonna be getting rid of the rain and the night. Ah! Nice. For the first time, my friends. I don't even know what this building is for, but I used it. It's nice. I used the bed. Thank you, whoever built that. It's seven freaking months ago. Oh, what the heck, I'm stuck. Anyway, um, I'm just about done with this. It's looking a little better. Looking a little better. I still got like two of these blocks to replace. And then uh, I'll be done. Yeah. And boom! We are done. We've got all of the, of the, all of the outside blocks replaced once again. Uh, still got to do the leaves. Still got to do the glass. We already talked about that. You guys can definitely leave me your opinion down in the comment section below. And uh, I do do a pretty good job of reading through the uh, through the comment section. Um, there are very few comments that I miss. Uh, but yeah, definitely leave down a comment. I will see it and I will take it into consideration if it is meaningful. That brings us to over here. What is this, my friends? What is this? This is a weird giant watery fountain type thingy. What is going on? Oh, a wishing well. Interesting. Throw in one gigabyte. Named with wish. Okay, luckily I have... Oh, I don't have any gigabytes. No gigabytes for me. Uh, I think Grazer built this. I want to say Grazer or somebody... Somebody bought um, this plot from a child dolphin and has built a wishing well. 
I don't know. I don't know, man. I think it's kind of cool. I think it's kind of cool. It's definitely just, uh, you know, give me money and you get nothing in return. Uh, looks like he's got some anvils. I don't see any dispensers around. I don't see any... I don't think I'm gonna get anything in return for this, you know, other than maybe feeling a little good. I don't, I don't really believe in wishing wells. I'm not that, uh, that super superstitious. Yeah, I think that's the right word. Uh, anyway, let's go over to, let's go back over here. I saw a sign, I saw a sign I wanted to go over with you guys. Let me eat some pie first. Shut up, Roy. Be quiet. Stop, no, stop it. Shh, be quiet. Be quiet. I'm trying, I'm going to have Minecraft. Damn it, I'm gonna go freaking give him something to do. Alrighty, okay, that was dealt with fairly quickly. Okay, let's go on, onward with what I was trying to talk about. Look at this! Look at this! Contact Grape for position at the cubicle. Paying nicely. Paying nicely, that is a big deal for me. Uh, P.S. I'm a good boss, just ask Carlton. I don't know who, oh actually, I do know who Carlton is. Carlton, Carlton! Hello, Carlton. Hello. How are you doing today? Is grape applesauce a good boss? Just let me, let me hear that that one one more time. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Tell me more. Tell me more. Does he smell bad? Oh. Oh, that's not a good sign. That is not a good sign. What about? Mm -hmm. Okay. Do we get do we get free coffee? At least. Yeah. Yeah. Free coffee. All right. I think that's good enough for me. Let's go check this out. So we are probably just going to be leaving down a sign for Mr. Grape Applesauce. Now, I don't know what floor he is on, so I will see you guys in just a second. Step one, stand on redstone block. There, there is no redstone block. I do not see a redstone block. I give up, I give up. All right, let's go up here. Let's go on up here, and it looks like we have this drops apartment. Oh, this is kind of nice. Snow. What the heck, man? Don't you get a little cold? I would not want snow for walls. Oh, look. Hmm, some hardened clay, some polished diorite, some pumpkins, pumpkins. And that's that's about it. All right, Strob, you got to get to work in your apartment, man. You got to get to work in your apartment. But luckily, right across this little dorm here, we got the cubicle. Let's go on inside and let's read off these wonderful signs. Mr. Grape, I am currently looking for a job and I heard you were the man to talk to. Dash Kermit. Uh, I left these signs here just now because we're looking for a job. If you guys cannot remember, I am homeless. I am the cubes hobo. I look like it. Look at this. Look at all my, my hobo -y hair. I look free coffee. Yahoo! Carlton did not let me down. We got, we got some coffee stands. That's nice. I like that. I like that. Coffee is expensive, man. I do not want to afford... You know, coffee is like more expensive than freaking a gallon of gas. That's not cool. It's not cool. But it looks like there's some pretty cool offices. Looks like you got a nice community, uh, community refrigerator here. I don't think I'll be using it because Kevin will probably steal all of my food because that's what Kevin does. But uh, yeah, hopefully Grape gets back to me soon. I really want to see what these are all about. Want to see what type, what type of a project he's working on back here? Get some nice little, get a good desk going. That'd be, that's crucial, you know. I need a good job. I need a good job. Um, unfortunately, my my life on the cube is just, it hasn't been very stable right now, man. Uh, hopefully, hopefully, grape can provide some some stability. Honestly, I, I need to be a little, just a little bit more self reliant, a little bit more self, little 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 bit more responsible. I guess would be the right word. Alrighty, well, I think that is going to do it for today's episode, my friends. It is another 20 minute or 20 minutes. I hope you guys like that. Um, 20 minutes. I'm trying to do kind of shorter episodes. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. I don't even know. What the heck. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Uh, definitely, once again, get back to me about the, um, the freaking farmer's market. The underwater alien market thing. Yeah, I need you guys' opinions. I'm completely stuck. I don't know what to do. Uh, but hopefully you guys can help me out. Refresh my, my creative juices. Feed me your creativity. Yeah, that's the way the cookie crumbles, right? Right. All right, well, with that, I hope you guys, once again, enjoyed. Like, favorite, comment, subscribe. You know the whole dealio. And I will see you guys 
in the next one. Yeah.